a dancer, although I like to call myself a dance activist because I really believe that dance has the power to connect people in many different situations, uh, whether it's an artistic performance or a community setting or um, just sharing the, the joy of movement with other people. So I've made dance my life's work in, in many different capacities and one of the things that is so um, essential to that for me is the ability to collaborate with other artists, whether in dance or music or painters or visual artists. And I think that that's really exciting because that collaborative process uh, allows me to explore my own creativity, to have the chance to experience other perspectives, to challenge me. And in this instance, uh, you know, we're looking at doing a, a project that's exploring the idea of Space. And from my perspective, um, how dance can be used to translate one's own personal experience of a space, and how it also opens up discussions or opportunities for other people to uh, explore space in new in new ways and in new ideas. So it opens up conversations, at different ideas of how you might think of something. Uh, so that's something that I find really stimulating, and um, looking forward to exploring further. I got inspired by a previous painting I did before. It was entitled Sayao Mindanao, meaning dance Minda now. And I tried to reincorporate it for my solo exhibition. And I was thinking like maybe to come up with something contemporary about a painting I did before. So um, I did this collaboration with Erica Rose to somehow give a deeper side of the painting. And with this, I would want to just actually um, retrace her and actually retrace the movement of what I'm about to do with her in the process. And maybe this is a good way to see the painting in a different light. It's like seeing what is the thinking behind the process of painting and hoping I could catch up with my intention of this. And I would call this as a project of my. Uh, Retrace, as I'm glad to call it.